23. Cause after you make that first one, it's all free bread for real. I don't know why that's gonna come up. Where you at, Aji? Pause. I got up by, by point four, basically. My facilitating finisher. Whose party is this? Can they make it? Uh, can they unlock it? I'm gonna start a new one. Nigga is on. You know what I'm saying? Like other niggas is on. Daryl, Steve, I mean Daryl, Steve, Tamar, Tay, my homeboy Tay. Goes all the way back to not just his off season, but the film study he's been doing during the week because I think he's found matchups that he likes and he's capitalizing. And a few times he's even defeated double teams. He doesn't care at this point. And I don't think this is the script they had in mind for their opening drive. This is third and long. Now it's Jackson. Steps away to his left. And he finds Safarian Jenkins. That's a good chunk of yardage. Oh, it's going to be run in the red. And we always talk about hidden yardage good. in a game. That's going to count as that because now it doesn't go on the books. But now they have to make that up you again. Don't they? Shoot you know I'm going to shoot you, bitch. And it's third down looking very tough after the whole game. I'm about to put my space creator on fucking gold. That's just going to be crazy. From I put that shit on all for real. That shit gave you so much pain. Talking about he's going to throw deep right side. I know once I really get my mid range complete. down, pack the more shooting bags, I'm gonna be mad for mid range, the dunk thing, they're gonna be like, yo. Bring up fourth down. You watch the tutorial. Take a game catch about the backfield a week ago, but they're trying to bomb him in that way in this game as well. But you can tell. Too many back to their game for me, bro. That's a lot. You gotta play a lot. Defensively, they told us, hey, we've gotta take him out of the passing game, limit it to just short runs. But he can really impact this offense. Three times lost last week as he sends this one away. my career game now? Taylor now yeah. returns. Look that jump, John. I got there. I played so terrific return there. 27 yards off to him. And the Chargers will be set up pretty well as they take over. You can't do that. You want to go to the park. Yeah, you can run in the park. Let's go to the street street court. We'll wait on Tamar. Yeah. Hopefully I get this. Hopefully I get this passing bag right here. I'm on the street street. 17-8. How many defensive badges do you get on that ball? No, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. I wish I got seven. I would have already had on my badge because I'd be strapping up on defense better. They'll have two yeah. remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. So here's a first and ten at the 38. It's just, this is some pressure. No, you can grab a Oh my God, any foul, man. The give to Taylor. 
into the end zone, and the touchdown record is now all his. An ideal start for them, really. You force the punt, and then you go down and score. And you've got to see a fast <coughs> pump on the sideline from the head coach, don't you? Because he's turned into his bench, and he's told his team, this is how we prepare. Force the punt, go downfield and score. I told you guys, it's just like a boxer in the gym preparing for the fight. Now we get to turn it all loose. This is fielded at the goal line. And he'll bring it a few past the 20 to the 23-yard line. Oh, God. This is, uh, hey, uh, Bro, join the party. I think it was on the late night, like, my career grind and shit. The Dolphins at the line, ready for their next drive. As we know, they had the chance last week, Charles, to lock up the division. Couldn't do it. Now it all comes down to the final week of the season. But once again, they control their destiny. And that's a good thing, but I wonder about mindset. Because you mentioned they had a chance to lock it up last week, didn't. Are they bringing extra pressure to themselves now? Even though they control their own destiny with a win, now because they didn't get it done before, will they be even tighter as they approach this game? And right now fighting for every win possible to try to at least secure home field for the wild card and or divisional round. So quickly all the way up at the 40-yard line. Yeah, and the Travis got Yeah. And that is incomplete. He couldn't hold on through the contact. Brings up second down. It's a lot of contact going on there, and in the end, unable to keep two hands on the football and bring it into his body. Everything looked pretty good until the finish. So second down and 10. Once again, they'll go from the 40. He pitches it out, and he is met quickly in the backfield. Down he goes, folded like a lawn chair. Call that a loss of three yards on the play. And they're going to be staring at a third and long here. And this would complete to Will Fuller. And he'll be taken down, but not before he works it past the 50. 17 yards for the Dolphins there as they've got themselves a first down. On the ready. So from Charger territory now. Here's a first and 10 at the 48-yard line. Now a give, right side, McFarland. Give him three on first down. It'll set up a second and seven. Yeah, that's my fault. He's short. To throw on second down, Moss. And he can't find a receiver, and he's brought down. But nothing takes a start to have a good drive quite like a big loss on a sack, does it? Now, now they're looking at a third and long, and suddenly the momentum shifted to the other side of the football. And old Mo is a very, very fickle man. <laughs> There's Jackson on third and long. Forced out to his left. He's going to run, but he's got to And I think the ball's out. And picked up by the Chargers. He had gained really good yardage. That's what you tell your quarterbacks, right? Get down after you've got the run. You don't have to prove your toughness. You know, I think that's what a lot of coaches are trying to preach to their guys. Get the yardage, get down, protect the football, and protect yourself from extra hits as well. Yeah, that fancy footwork and with him on first down. I should it's crazy, Taylor. Bro. I should try to run inside, but nothing there. No gain on the play. It'll be second down. And he got off the end there very quickly to make that play. Yeah, it was almost like the bullet train, wasn't it? I mean, just zoom, quick, 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 and what a terrific play, holding them to no gain. On second down. It's Taylor. And here's another tackle made at the line. So they're converging well on the football now. Call it no gain on the run there, and now they'll be looking at a third down. Two runs for a net gain of nothing. Now here's third and ten. Working out of the shotgun. Here's Allen. No. In a heavy traffic, and it's intercepted. 
picked off around the 37. And he'll take it across midfield and down to the 48-yard line. So that flag will cost him 15. And it doesn't matter anymore how you get the face mask. Any part of it is going to be 15 yards. You know, I, I know when it gives me the animation. I know when it doesn't, though. And now I'm it's first like, and 10, a big really mistake, animation. especially when you factor in the personal foul yardage. He's going to go out of bounds, but he takes this one down just shy of the 20. Give him 12 yards there, and the Dolphins have a first down. Well, partner, for a few years, we thought this read option play was going to take over the whole NFL. It seemed like everyone was using it, but it has been scaled back considerably in the last few seasons, mainly because people are worried about their quarterbacks getting hit. But when you call it at the right time and you use it properly, you see the type of gains you can get. A nice chunk of yardage there. You know there I do that sometimes, bro. Like you got to see the floor. That yeah, means you're giving it your head down. You know how, you know how long I was at the three-point line, nigga. I was, I was. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. I'm to him that, bro. To throw is Jackson, and he fires one that's intercepted. Picked off at the 14. I'm just trying to him that, bro. Can I get 13 shoot, bro? Yeah, bro. Really I got to make a good one. Back to the 25-yard line. And you know what this do. I tell you what, credit is due there on them you preventing the touchdown after that interception. How about him chasing him down and not giving up the and pick the badges, six? badges, I'm a booster, bro. I'm only going to shoot the corner. I told you how I'm a building. I told you how I'm building. It's going to hit. And I got 72 mid-range, bro. I got to get my badges, catch and shoot. Still a great return and very good field position. That shit not gonna hit. That shit only gonna hit if you're gonna be on the ground. Bro, I hit now. I hit now. <laughs> Three yards on the pick up there, and it'll be second down. They did a really nice job there defensively. They strung the play out, didn't give him a cutback lane. On each play, you have guys what I call our BCR players. Guys are responsible for the bootleg, for the cutback, and for the reverse. They played that one perfectly. And rode him right out of bounds. In a double coverage, and it's intercepted. Picked up by Quan Alexander. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. 94. From deep in their own territory, they look to throw. He rifles one that's intercepted. Picked off at the 24. And his guys are going to get the football at the 23-yard line. That's not one that he's going to want to remember, but he had to get it out of the way at some point, his first career interception. And if he's the guy that they think he is, he's not laughing it off, but he's also not going to let it affect him as the game proceeds. He's going to go back out there, still be the same confident kid, the reason that they drafted him, and go out and play. They'll run with Taylor, and they'll bring him down at the 18-yard line. Five yards on the carry, good pickup on first down. <laughs> Getting the sense, Charles, are going to put a big emphasis this afternoon on the run game. And why not? What we're seeing so far is working pretty well from them. And here's the best part. We always talk about the best performers do their job when the lights come on. I think he likes natural light best. <coughs> the hitter here is complete. And he'll take it down here just shy of the 15 at the 16-yard line. Definitely do it, We just need a better third. Brings up third down. Allen going to try and throw on third down. And that one is incomplete. And it also concludes quarter number one. 6 nothing. our score after one. And the 11-year veteran bangs it through. And that will make yeah, our score assists away from mine too. nothing. I got one. the interception, but very two little last game. I got nine no one. I need about like eleven hundred. Three, and it does feel like settling with that. Like it certainly three, does, three, but we gotta give a lot of credit where it's due, and that's to the defense because they ran onto the field. This is what we call sudden change, right? Interception. You gotta go put out the fire, and they did, holding them to a field goal. But I will go to the other side so we get a ball first. Niggas that hop on this John eventually.
Oda. The Dolphins had the line ready for their next drive. They'll be in search of their initial points in the contest, trailing 9 0 as they begin with a first down. A run there on first down gets three up to the 28. A gain of three, second down. I don't think any of us were surprised that they decided to start this drive on the ground after the last two drives yeah. ended in interceptions. Unfortunately, though, not a lot going on on that first play. Yeah, I think the anticipation was felt also by the defense. Here's second and seven now from the 28. Here's a second and seven. His throw incomplete. Philip Dorsett, the intended receiver. And that takes us from second to third down. My well, man's getting a little loose with the football there, right? Interception before, almost had one here. He's got to start taking better care of it. Yeah, really should have oh, been wow. back to back drives with interceptions. He's lucky there. Dancing to his left. And that will be incomplete. You hear the calls for a penalty, but I just don't think so. I think in this situation, the defender was making sure his guy couldn't hold on to the football. So I don't see anything to warrant you the flag. No, I'm 22. with you. There was contact, but I'm happy they years. kept that flag in the back pocket. And the punt over yep. the side in the air. I'm going to give him relentless finisher and Johnny Slayer my next two. I'm going to get them to gold, and then I might switch them. I think I'm going to just keep fancy footwork and silly finisher on gold and have, like, relentless finisher, Hall, Giant Slayer, Hall. Consistent in contact finisher hall. I don't need uh, I don't need lives to finish. I'll be banging out, and I get 25 playmaking. And I'm saying with 13 shooting, if I have four golds and flexible release on bronze, bro, with four golds, nigga, I'm gonna be cashing, catch and shoot gold, corner specialist gold. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be I'm gonna, I'm gonna be cashing. That's why I'll be trying to get them, but I'll play more of my career games to get them. I really ain't been playing my career. Niggas played a duty, then I hop on Madden, so this is the only time I got to build. I'll be trying to shoot. Every once in a while. I mean, I drive all the time. My field goal percentage is, like, through the roof now. <laughs> Everything at the cup. All right, Tamar, Tamar, we about to run one more. Hopefully you're done after this one. Too. Oh, oh, one of my young boys, one of my young boys on there, fucking live with the sound guy. I was on live with him. I don't know why the fuck the sound had him on that rapping, but I don't know if he's on that rapping. The Charger drive about to get going. They've shown precious little here offensively thus far as they try again with a first down now. Well, today was a funny ass day, but I ain't even gonna lie, that shit. That shit oh, had niggas down. on 10 a day. That nigga hot in the city now, and kept off that shit. Come on, I'll be knowing, bro. That nigga was just talking about that nigga. He was a little tight talking about that nigga, bro. But just yeah. to be in the discussion, obviously that means he's had a great run. The raw numbers put him in the discussion. Can he carry his team to enough victories? Can he put him in a spot where we say to ourselves, well, an MVP carries his team to the playoffs. That's what he's going to need in order to get that award. And a nice move will yield nothing as he stopped behind the line. It'll be a loss of one, and it'll be second and 11. <laughs> Oh. They'll try the right side here with Davis. The second down play, not much better than the first. Just a gain of one there. 
Well, they had that one sniffed out. Excellent run blitz. Stopped that one for a short game. What makes a good run blitz a good run blitz? The ability to stay on task, to follow up your assignment, go to the gap you're supposed to cover, and not be deterred by anything else. Throwing now is Hamlin. And he's got his man, Marquise Brown. And he's able to get this to the 40-yard line before he's out of bounds. 16 yards is the pickup there and a first down for L.A. A first down carry for Davis. Listen, I feel him there, bro. And give him you six yards here right. as he stopped near the 35 and like, I feel at the Will, 34. He feel like shit, oh. like, he just signed back to the city like he played real good and like you feel me, like his numbers do speak for that. So he can like he you know you put in that work, he can guard, he can guard anybody. But then I feel him like nigga like just cause you in the league don't mean you know you're not human cause there's a lot of niggas in the league that like other niggas is better than an ain't getting a chance. You feel me? Like I feel him. I feel both sides of that. I feel like I'm trying to put my clothes because everybody, everybody, you can pass on the nose. Come on, man. Yeah, yeah. I didn't see that. I didn't see that at first. I didn't see that at first. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm 10, 20 days, you can pass on the nose. You could have given more, too. Given more came on the joint and said, bro. At first, he was chilling. He said, bro, I'm chilling. He was like, eight out of the first half of football. I forgot what he said, but he was like, yo, eight out of ten, like, you really can't go there. He said, you can't go there, bro. He's like, you got to go to your career right now. He's like, you're going to get in the league. 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 Like, That's what DJ Moore told him. Yeah, he was bitching like, like I'm here in the league, sometimes. like I'm really like more. Like, DJ Moore not like that. Like, yeah, I'm like, so the ball position now with like the three. Here's second and goal. They'll try to run yeah, this one. Yeah, yeah. Now he fights his right. own for a charger touchdown. Yeah, he better play oh, like a bitch here because he's talking shit. Like even if it's even though it's just live, like the Chargers, they're able to widen their lead. A little bit of a little bit of come with it too. Everybody got to come with it. Everybody got to come with it. I don't know. Anybody from the city got to come with it. Anybody that just comes to the city got to come with it. Oh, he's a good one. Yeah, 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 they will not That's get a chance to return this one as it's through the end zone for a touchdown. If he back in the Eagles and he not playing good, that shit gonna be bad for him. The Dolphins at the line ready for their next drive. Yeah, everybody knew that. Two touchdowns here in the first half. This becomes a pretty important drive. I know, but he was on live talking shit. Everybody can feel it. Shaquille Barrett, he's the culprit, yeah. and that is now his 13th sack of the season as his great year continues. Sacks a growing theme in this first half. This is second and long. Oh, that's what's bad about it. What's that 20 bands? Oh, yeah, I was feeling bad as shit. Like, if my partner ever said that, like, a beat you, that like, I beat you 10 out of 10 times in one of I'd be like, nigga, what? Man, he's a draft, man. He's going to play corner. He came on the joint with the bands, like, he showed 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 the I'm talking about Bruce and him, and you told Bruce to sit him down, step him out three times. He's like, Bruce wanted to get three catches on him. I think that's a great question, because that's what they're going to check on. Oh, niggas is talking spicy. The coach is going to check on, his teammates are going to check on it. Because when you haven't done it before, you got to see how you're going to react. Let's see how it bounces back. Yeah, there's two interceptions for him in college and a half. I mean, that just didn't happen. No. Uh, more than stimulus check. <laughs> no, but I know what he get into, so that's that's my he got a studio and shit, bro. So he be oh, he be oh yeah, 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 yeah. He, he get some money. Yeah. Right, yeah. He used to he used to he used to play ball. Nigga, that's so we've come up on halftime here in week man. 17. As we send you to our EA Studios uh, in Orlando, oh, yeah, here's yeah. Jonathan Coach. My young boy wear it now. My young boy Manny. Yeah, man. Yeah, Manny oh, he, Robinson. Oh, yeah, man. My other young boy, Rich Carter. Yeah. Rich Rich, Manny Rich, was Rich. supposed to go to the... Manny was supposed to go to the league this year. He was on all the draft radars, bro. Like, uh, you know, like the... What's the... The, the, the Jim Nagy Reese's Bowl the shit? The senior stuff for that? Like, had him, like, as the top corner prospect, bro. Like, he doesn't go uh, through the top. He used to work out with him in Baltimore. Good talk, bro. He tore his ACL, so he come to bat. He only played like one game. But with all this shit going on, he probably should have just declared. This shit is wicked. 
the Charger drive about to get going. They built a good Dude. first half lead. Now they have a chance to add on to it. And what I'm thinking is that the offensive staff spent the entire halftime just working with them okay, on here's what we think they're going to do to attack they us in the second half. Nice first half that we've had, guys, but be prepared for some change-ups. We're going to see how we can get off in the second half. See how they handle any adjustments that might be made to They said what? Uh, no, I'm just gonna talk about it. trying to say, hey, yeah, like, he's going for real. This is what else he was talking about. Like, calling niggas ass and shit like that. Like, that yeah, niggas, uh, I like, wasn't necessarily ass, ass, but, like, you know, down. he basically said, like, he's gonna lose his ass. They're trying to show you how to run the ball, protect this lead. Give it to the backs, put a little bit of keep away, don't you think? And that's probably a good philosophy at this point. Cause I got, I got, what's the name, Fry him? I got, what's the name, Fry, uh, Will. Good one at five okay. yards, so make it okay. second and five. Yeah. Oh, I got him Give trying him. Sure. It'll be second down. Fast with Will, bro. Here's Davis running right. I can't believe he didn't get no chance at all. I didn't know Joe Walker was on the bear for a little bit. Seeing his good profile picture. They're making it look easy out there. Another first down. So some quick drive. Let me do this a little bit of math. Four plays, three first downs. That's pretty good recipe for success. Yeah, I thought at least the XFL or something. My man got to the XFL. He only had one collegiate touchdown. Great effort there. His fifth touchdown yeah. now yeah. on the year. Yeah, put, uh, uh, you know, you don't really got to put much film up when you had a big speed like that, bro. Yeah. That pushes the lead up to 23. Yeah. Super talented. He should have probably went somewhere a little bit smaller, though, bro. Yeah, but you know, when it comes from the city, bro, when you get a school like George, you're going to jump on it. And that'll carry over the back line of the end zone for a touchdown. He ain't going there because he's going to have top niggas. The Dolphins at the line ready for their next drive. And their halftime hole now even deeper. And they need a big drive here just to answer the first touchdown of the second half scored. And he's going to be intercepted a third time. Here's the Dolphins on second and four. But there's a lot of knowledge to be gleaned every time you throw an interception if you do things the right way. And hasn't there been a pretty darn good quarterback along the way who threw a lot of interceptions early, learned from them, and became great later? Who would that be? Maybe one Peyton Manning. Yeah, this 28 is crazy. His rookie year. That's the NFL record. How things turn out for him? I think okay. He's a guy in all the commercials now, right? <laughs> yeah, I think he's doing okay. Second and ten now from the 27. Let him know. Let him know. Okay. Now a give right side. Taylor. And he'll get it down this time to the 17. They'll wind up getting 10 back as that sets him up for third down. So from second and long, now we go to third and very manageable. Yeah, they love that phrase, don't they? Because as an offensive coordinator, you can keep people a little bit off balance in guessing because you don't have to throw it. You can come back with a strong run game if you want to. And if you're in four down territory, that really opens things up for you. They go to the ground again with Taylor. And he will reach the five-yard line before going out of bounds. They're able to convert on third down, and that sets up a first and goal. So it's pretty simple, partner. You pick up a turnover, set you up in excellent field position. The last thing you want to do is go three and out in this spot. Yeah, they would have had to settle for a field goal attempt, but now they keep those touchdown hopes alive. And that play going absolutely nowhere as he's belted before he could get out of the backfield. They'll wind up losing three yards here, and it'll be second and goal. Like the boy, uh, well, you a Ravens fan, fucking. Come on, Joe. Yeah, you a Ravens fan, Tim Martin. The nigga's a high water shit in there. Second TD of the game, his sixth on the year. And the Chargers capitalize on the short field. This ain't take it in for six. One of my homies that uh, fucking. Hopkins with the extra point. And that one will extend this big lead. He's gonna be in the Olympics. He's gonna be in the Olympics. He's gonna be in the Olympics. Whenever the Olympics start back up, he's gonna be on that flag team. That's gonna be in the Olympics. The kickoff team on the field now yeah, is yeah, in 2024. 
No, it's this year, bro. Or and this will not right be now. returnable. No, he said he said the year, bro. On on it. Oh, he did. Yeah, it's 2024. Oh, why, why, why? Mm -hmm. He was like, yeah, he trying to bid on me or whatever. He's like, I still ride him up, like. He's like, and I'm gonna be in the Olympics in 2024. Oh, yeah, 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 that's tough. But anyway, man, I'm going to other thing. Will Park, he said, uh, Will Park said he can guard my man Bruce. Uh, and they were all the other niggas. And they were going back and forth. That shit was like, <laughs> that shit was funny because you got to teach that shit all the way down to the niggas really been playing each other like since high school and going up with each other since high school. Except that squad I'm like, Tamar, we had the right door. Oh, I'm about to jump on too. I'm about to this game. Oh, I got it. It's from the ass, but...